Hi Scorpio, welcome to your reading. This is a general love reading. Now let's continue, let's shuffle this deck four times for you. So let's start with what went wrong in the past, what were the challenges there? Problems with stability, lack of maturity, yes, it was about that. Queen of Pentacles, King of Pentacles. It was not a mutual interest here for building a stronger connection. Some, someone may have uh, wanted just something casual, taking a time off and wanting to withdrawal or to collect their thoughts, maybe telling the other partner, let me find more time and think about that, just lots of confusion. And there may have been a possible rejection as well, an, a love offer, a love offer that was uh, rejected and there, and then there was silence no communication so that's what i'm getting but let's see more details what is affecting you in your subconscious at this moment you still have that big vision and dream about long-term happy commitment but uh, because this is mixed with pessimism as well focusing too much on what went wrong there's some avoidance, wanting to leave, on the other hand, the connection completely, wanting to move away from something that was not working, and to just not deal with lies anymore. Now let's see about how do you view this situation with them. You don't see them getting, giving attention to you. Or you getting much success, even by putting energy into the situation, you think that maybe the connection would be superficial now if it was to be restarted, or that they not like anymore to give energy to the connection, and maybe it has ended completely, the cycle is over, and you're just wasting your time waiting, so that's the kind of perception you may be having about the current situation. Now let's see more details. Your focus is, yes, to be cold, but in a good way. To be logical, as a matter of fact, to not tolerate red flags and misbehaviors anymore. Also, you don't want the connection to be cold and them to be not emotional towards you, something like that. Uh, you want and you hope for more maturity for them, a more emotional stability. You hope that they still love you and that their love is strong and mature and serious. Now let's see about the current energies. Some of you may get a communication from this false person. I'm getting communication as a, as a way to just not let this a relationship slip away completely. There is love and feelings there, or it may just be telling that you have a strong desire to talk or meet them because you have feelings and you don't want to let it end. Now, do you believe in stability long term? No, you don't think there will be easy to have a long term commitment with them. That's why you have kept this distance and you didn't want to deal with dramas anymore. 
But you keep watching with the intention to talk or to see what's up, where the situation, where the energies are at this moment. Some of you will get a communication. That's what I'm getting. Now it may be you that communicates or them that start the communication. Let's clarify why the Eight of Wands. Okay, it's uh, it's thinking a lot about communication. It's not that it was telling it will happen. It is telling that somebody, one of you, I think mostly it is uh, telling about your energies, wanting to talk. You have a strong desire to talk to them because you still love them. Now let's see about them. What are their energies towards you? For, the, for this, let's shuffle uh, this other deck four times. And if you think they are avoiding you, here's the real truth. I'm getting them just waiting, not doing anything, for now at least. They think it ended in the worst way possible. It ended in a terrible way. It felt like a betrayal, or it was a betrayal. They're keeping this distance, but with waiting in the back of their mind. They postpone the communication. They, they see a big disconnection this moment. They think that you two are not connected as much as before, but... They have a void in their love life. They feel empty and unsure, unhappy. They want to find that sunny moment again, that harmony into a connection. They reflect a lot. Yes, they just keep reflecting but not doing anything and keeping this distance. And it is because that kind of ending and uh, even the friendship, they hesitate to send a friendly message. But why are they waiting? So they are waiting if you will do something, but they are not willing to do something themselves. They are waiting and not doing something themselves because they think it has ended completely. It cannot be restarted. They may have done something wrong. And they can't find the courage to restart it because they know it cannot be restarted. The only possible way is if you uh, did forgive them. And if it was an attempt from your side, because they themselves can't find that courage to approach you. That's uh, what I'm getting here. Now, I will continue this reading in the extended with more details about them. I will cover what kind of feelings do they have towards you at this moment? How do they view you from the outside? What are their intentions for now? Let's see more details about that. Also, what are the mutual energies and the energies around each one of you? If you want to watch the extended of this video, you can find it now in the description box below this video. Or if you are watching this from your mobile phone, you can just click the title. The description box will expand and at the top you can find the extended link. Thank you for watching. See you the next reading and bye for now.